We are Linda Barnes and this is Sarah McGrath, <laughs> directors at 360 Search. So we specialise in insurance, reinsurance, life pensions, investments and finance in Dublin and in London. So we joined the Recruitment Entrepreneur portfolio about three and a half years ago um, and we've been kind of going from strength to strength ever since. Well, the value that the ORE partnership brings is, you know, it, it goes beyond you know, your day to day. It's mentorship. It's working with the guys as a sounding board. They're there for you when it's difficult. They were fantastic with us in helping us shape the business through COVID. Like the list is as long as my arm, you know, it's, it's I think, but a real solid foundation, strong advice, commercial advice, as well as an injection of cash, which you can't ignore. So my advice to anybody starting or thinking about starting a recruitment business is one, Think about the specialism and stick with it. So the market leaders are all the very, very best people in specialisms. Two, make sure that you have some sounding board and some level of mentorship around, either be somebody in that industry that can guide you. And three, make sure that you've done all the research and have faith, I guess, that all the hard work will eventually pay off. Well, I think if you're thinking about investment, definitely from our experience, you know, make sure that you know the people and you firstly like the people that you're getting into business with and you trust them and that they have experience in, in investing in other businesses and you can look at potential case studies where you can maybe picture your own business, but also not to overshot on year one to make sure that you plan your cost base so you're getting, you know, the, the amount of cash injection is correct, that it's not too much and it's not too little. Top tips to continue thriving over the next 12 months are really just to embrace it and get ready for all the change that's coming because we've seen astronomical backlogs of strategic hiring, so enjoy it all now while it's happening. Over the next 12 months, I guess, we can only go with what we've learned. We've learned a huge amount, and I think one thing I will add to what Linda said is working with your team, you know, clear, concise leadership, you know, very, very authentic and being transparent with the guys about the goal of the business and where we want to go and what we're trying to achieve because the market is moving at pace and if you are not moving with it then you're going to miss out big time.